Hello, I'm Scott Fitzgerald with Optical Cable Corporation, and today I'm going to demonstrate for you how to install our Express Ultra SC and LC connectors onto a 900 micron buffered fiber. The specific tools you will need are a cable jacket stripper, a precision fiber cleaver, a visual fault locator, an attenuator, launch cable, and zirconia split sleeve for visible fault checking, a thermal buffer removal tool, lint-free wipes and cleaning solution, and all of these tools are available from OCC as a complete kit. Step 1. Preparing the connector. Remove the connector from the bag, saving the bag for later to refer to for the strip length. Inspect your connector. The wedge clip should be flush against the connector. Squeeze sideways to ensure that it is fully seated. Step 2. Installing the boot onto the fiber. Install the boot onto the 900 micron buffered fiber. If you are terminating onto bare fiber, first install the furcation tubing to furcate up to 900 micron, and then install the boot over the tubing. Step 3. Stripping the fiber buffer. Strip the buffer to a minimum of 30 millimeters. You need to strip all the way down to the 125 micron cladding. Step 4. Screening and cleaning the fiber. Bend the fiber back and forth with your finger. If the fiber breaks, restrip it and try again. If the fiber does not break, Clean the bare fiber using a lint-free wipe moistened with your cleaning pen. Step 5. Cleaving the fiber. Insert your fiber into the cleaver such that the buffer aligns with the 10 millimeter mark on the gauge. Close the, the upper cover, push the button to cleave, and open the cover back up. After cleaving, verify that the cleave length is 10 millimeters. For your convenience, there's a scale printed on the bag the connector came in that shows this. Step 6. Preparing the visual fault locator. Assemble the visual fault locator, attenuator, single mode launch cable, and zirconia split sleeve. Choose the launch cable and zirconia split sleeve that match the connector you are terminating. Step 7. Installing the Express Ultra Connector. Install the Express Ultra Connector onto the zirconia split sleeve and the launch cable. When you do this, you should see red light showing through the first window in the connector. Step 8. Inserting the fiber. Insert the fiber into the Express Ultra connector and ensure that there's a slight bend in the fiber. You should see an obvious change in the light shown in the two windows. Step 9. Removing the wedge clip. Lift the gate and squeeze the sides of the wedge clip to remove it from the connector. This will securely lock the connector to your fiber. Step 10. Troubleshooting. If bright light is still seen in the windows of the connector, you may adjust the connector properties by reattaching the wedge clip, and re-terminating your fiber. Repeat steps 3 through 10. This can be done a maximum of one time. Step 11. Fitting the boot. Align the holes in the side of the boot with the tabs on the side of the connectors, and push until you hear a clicking sound, or it is visibly obvious that the connector boot is fully seated. Congratulations, your termination is now complete. For additional information on the OCC Express Ultra LC and SC fiber connectors and other related products, visit our website at occfiber.com.